Green Book is nominated in six categories, including Best Picture, as well as Best Lead Actor and Best Supporting Actor. Green Book is about Tony Lip, the Italian-American working class racist man who gets a job working as a driver for Don Shirley, an African-American pianist touring the American Deep South during the 60s. So I went into this movie really expecting not to like it. And I think that might be part of why I really did enjoy myself. And I'm really ashamed to say that, but I actually had a really nice time watching this movie. But it did live up to some of those negative expectations. I think it is pretty much similar to Bohemian Rhapsody in the sense that it's, it's that kind of biopic where there's nothing too fancy going on, uh, nothing too interesting, sort of sentimental, by the numbers kind of stuff going on. It's just that for some reason with Green Book, I just fell for it. It just worked on me. Everything they did worked, everything they did. And I think I just, I just really like it. I, I just like that pleasant little story about this lovely little friendship that develops between the two of them. They both have their own kind of assumptions about each other. Uh, Viggo Mortensen's character is really looking down on Mahersha Ali's character because of, you know, racism. <laughs> but the reverse is also happening where Mahershala Ali's character is looking down on Viggo Mortensen's character because he's not an upper class kind of guy. He's kind of working class and eats grubby food and stuff like that. I prefer not to get grease on my blanket. Ooh, I'm gonna get grease on my blanket. And it just felt so sweet to see them hate each other in the beginning and there didn't need to be any crazy thing happening they just needed to spend enough time together to realize that they actually like each other. Though obviously it's not exactly equivalent. One character's just a little bit more hateful and the other's a lot more mature and grown up and they get along. And these things are like imagined barriers. And I, I liked it a lot. <laughs> I'm sorry I liked it. As far as the performances go, uh, I think Viggo Mortensen really especially deserves this nomination. I thought he was really great. He's just so fun to watch and he didn't feel like he was caricaturing that type of person too much. Maybe it's a little bit caricatured, but I just bought everything he did. I, I, I felt like it was believable and that he didn't look down on this kind of person. He wasn't playing the character in, in a totally idiotic, stupid way. Mahershala Ali, on the other hand, I felt like he did okay most of the movie, but especially in that very first scene that you see him, I think, I don't know if that was early on in the shooting, but it felt like he wasn't quite sure how to play this character and he was caricaturing just a little bit. There was even like an honest to God, hmm, I'm so prim and proper kind of thing that he was doing. There were really low dips in that performance, but overall, I think he did have great moments too. He, he, he did keep it together more or less. There's nothing all too challenging about this movie. There's nothing that really stands out as spectacular moments in the movie. It's just like a beautiful, sweet friendship story. And it's nice to watch on a Saturday or Sunday afternoon, just to, to, to make yourself feel good. That's what this movie is. It's just a feel good movie. It's just a nice, pleasant movie. There is a lot of tension, obviously, for obvious reasons in the plot. They're going down into the deep south and there's like moments of danger and you're worrying. So it's not just one smooth ride all the way. It's a roller coaster of emotions, but it's a pleasant roller coaster where you're pretty sure that even when things get dark, they'll, they'll get good again. So it's that kind of movie. That's it. That's all I got. I don't want to talk about whether or not this is worth nominating for the Oscars. I just like it. And I'm in no position to say it doesn't deserve a nomination because I fell for it. 